You have? Yeah. What book? All right. Nasty Nathaniel out here in the city of Walnut, California. And right now I'm going to be conducting a First Amendment audit of the Walnut Post Office. Yeah, another post office audit. We're going to make sure that our friends at the United States Postal Service here in the city of Walnut respect and honor my constitutional right to record in public. And I hope that Merb will approve of this video. Sign light right there lets me know exactly where I'm at. In big uh, red, white, and blue, United States Postal Service. Can't miss it. Flying high and proud is Old Glory. You will almost always see uh, Old Glory flying high uh, at a post office. So, like I just mentioned, uh, I'm in the city of Walnut. This is uh, an upscale community. And I haven't done a post office audit in a while. It's been, it's been a while since I've uh, hit one of these places. I know there was a period where myself and a lot of other auditors were, were uh, doing the post office audits pretty regularly. And the reason for that, well, I'll just speak for myself, you know. You know, it never failed to amaze me that no matter how many post office audits I did, or other ones that I saw others auditors doing, how they would continue to respond. You're not supposed to take pictures of uh, the federal building without the... Uh... Sir, no pictures, sir. You need to read poster seven. Sorry, just trying to get a good shot of your face. Oh, I thought maybe you wanted to dance. Actually, we can record here. Please don't touch my camera. I'm not touching your camera. Well, you're, you're getting awful close to me. And, then, and freak out and... I don't know if you want to call it going postal. I know that sounds kind of cheesy, but you know, I always thought at some point with as many of these videos that are out there of First Amendment audits of post offices, I always thought that eventually like a memo or something would go out, you know, letting the postal workers know about First Amendment auditors and, and you know, what we're doing and you know, over time we would get a different response. That or we'd get no response. But, you know, like I said, it just never failed to amaze me no matter how many times I would go and audit a post office, I would just get this, you know, total overreaction by the postal employees. So I'm gonna audit this post office. Like I said, I haven't done one in a while. See how they uh, react to an individual exercising the right to practice public photography. Front entrance, got some people going in. It's pretty active. You know, there's a lot of people coming in here. I don't know if this is the only post office in town or or what, but uh, it's about 3.30 in the afternoon on this very hot Tuesday afternoon, and it is hot. Oh, mama, is it? That's another shot of the, the side of the building. Some people going in to mail packages or maybe pick up mail if they have a post office box that they've rented. So I'm walking around the side of the building and looks like it's kind of a newer structure. You know, it definitely doesn't look like the, the old Hollywood post office that I did. Uh, several months back. I think that was the last post office audit I ever did. We got like a mystery door right there. But yeah, I'm gonna go over here to the the back gate and uh, check out the action over here. So uh, how about y'all come along and join me? Yeah. So we got a postal vehicle going in there. So here it is. This is uh, the back gate that leads into like the loading dock. And looks pretty active back here as well, just as it does in the front. They got uh, a lot of vehicles and, oh, there's somebody. Yeah, he's uh, 
for a tank top, like, oh, uh, he's like... Somebody there, I don't know what they're doing, but, yeah. Look at that, that big diesel engine going. There's somebody there. He doesn't look happy. How you doing? Who you are? Huh? Who you are? Uh, who are you? Oh, that was strange. All right, we got a uh, we got a big rig coming out here. Give him some room. Oh wow. Oh, give me a thumbs up. I guess he's uh, okay with public photography. Well, that's good. Uh, there's this guy. Saw him. Uh, uh, that's the rifle man right there. He was. Looks like he was mailing. Him. How you doing? Hi. How you doing? Good. How are you? Good. Are you doing an audit? I'm doing a. <laughs> wow. How did you know? <laughs> I love what you do. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being nice. Yeah, I didn't mean to spook you, you know. No, no, Just doing a story about the post office, you know. Keep up the good work. All right, thank you. you need it. Have a great day, sir. Wow, that was really cool. Wow. I guess some people in the public do appreciate us. This is all. This is, uh, this is it, folks. This, is, uh, this lady here, she doesn't know what she's doing. She's, like, kind of scared or... Should she back up or what? Or, I don't know. She's having a Porsche. That's a nice car. Be careful, don't get run over. Oh, I won't. How you doing? How do you like that Porsche? I love it. Oh, cool. Awesome. Have a great day. Thank you. Wow, people are pretty nice here. Well, folks, I'm pleasantly, pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. So I'm back up here at the front again. I'm gonna, gonna take a quick look inside. This is gonna be the final test. Uh, see how they react to my filming in the public lobby. See how, see how they do and so forth. hours some advertisements up there these are the, the smaller post office boxes and then you know if you want a bigger one they have larger size ones but of course those cost more and this is where you get different pamphlets and forms kind of sign some more stuff right here they got that like oh, kind of interesting looking pen kind of, what is that like a a marijuana plant oh, mail This is like uh, for, I think this is for like, yeah, general delivery pickup. And uh, let's see if we see poster seven. I know everybody always talks about poster seven when it comes to post office audits that I don't, I don't see it here. Oh, excuse me. How you doing? Oh yeah, yeah this is the public lobby, some people going about their business. Well, the lines aren't as long here, so that's good. Yep. 
All right, folks. I don't know. What do you think? I don't know about you guys, but uh, I think they passed. Well, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this audit up and say this was a pass. I'm going to give the Walnut uh, Post Office a pass. They passed every uh, aspect of the test. I filmed uh, from the sidewalk as well as I went inside and filmed in the lobby. And nobody bothered me. Nobody freaked out. Nobody uh, gave me a hard time. Even met a uh, supporter. So definitely call this a pass. If you guys feel differently, uh, please say so in the comments or, or whatnot. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, all that groovy stuff. Nasty Nathaniel saying happy trails. Now I think it's time for me to go have a cold one.